Hi. Okay. Um, I'm Cynthia, and this is my first video, and I'm doing this for two reasons. I did a swap, and I won a contest nine months ago that I promised to do a video, and I didn't till now because I'll explain that. Anyways, so I did a swap with Liz, who is EP3074 on Twitter and on YouTube. And I'm in Canada, and she's in uh, Michigan. I'm in Ontario. So what we did was that because our dollars are pretty similar, we did the same amount. So we did about $50 plus shipping. And so I'm going to show you guys what she sent me. And she also has a video of what I sent her, which is kind of cool. So she sent me a lot of stuff. <laughs> so it was really neat. So I'm going to start out with the nail polishes because she sent me nine of them and some of them she purchased, ones like I wanted, and then some of them she gave me because she didn't care for the colors. So I'm going to start out with the ones that I am I know and I'm pretty positive she gave me. So the first one was that she got me Green with Envy from Sally Henson Extreme Wear. So I thought that was pretty cool because she knows I love green because we chatted a little bit on Twitter and stuff. Well, we talk a lot on Twitter, so. And then she got me Minted from Revlon, which is really neat because um, Michelle Bell or something, we all know who Michelle is. Anyway, she just did the um, mint green nail polish and she had all the swatches on her hands. And I didn't know that I, I've always looked at this one, but I didn't know I'd like it as much as I did. So that was kind of cool. She sent me this one, which I've never seen. Um, so it's Mint Sorbet, which I like the color. It looks, they look similar, but they aren't. Like they're gonna be, they're gonna be different. Like they look, they look similar, but they really aren't. And then this one, I'm pretty sure, I don't know if this is new or not. Actually, I think it is, because <laughs> it says new shade. And it's called Carbonite. I have on and it's really cool looking. I don't know if you can see. See it's like it's hard to explain. I'm really excited to try that one out. And then these are the exciting ones. So this is the one that is the big deal because I want Essie's de Bush really badly because it's supposedly a lighter version of So Sight. And it's really hard to find Essie in Canada. And Shoppers Drug Mart just got it in the fall, at least mine did. And I, and I got them there, but they're eleven ninety nine. And then just recently, like this summer, Walmart got them and they're eight ninety nine. So it's a little bit better, but it's, but I haven't seen the bush. It's only like the main color, so they're still so psyched. And there's Mig Muffs and there's Chinchilla, and that's it. Like there's no spring colors. There's no summer colors. Well, actually, no, we did have the summer colors, and I got, you know, the Brazilian orange and stuff like that, and I'm absolutely sure. But this is supposedly the dupe for the bush. It's sinful colors, and it's called seaweed. So I'm really excited about that, because I've never heard of sinful colors, so we obviously don't have it up here, or my town's just a little too small. And then because she asked me what I thought about it and all that, and I said, that's awesome. She, I asked her if she could actually get me this one, which is really nice. So this one is Adventure Island by Sinful Colors. So it's kind of like a yellowy green. There you go. Um, yeah, so you can tell that like they're really different. And then from finger paint she got me military green which was nice because uh, we went online and we were like looking at blogs and new nail polishes that were coming out and stuff like that so we really liked it. And then yeah, there's two more. I know I got spoiled. I have nine nail polishes. Like that's insane. And then open seas which is really neat because it's like a blue green. Um, so beside here, the military green of finger paints. See, it's like really blue. So I thought that'd be really nice. My, I'm gonna like that one probably. Um, 
And then this one, this is the one that like I, I kind of freaked out over because I knew I was getting um, the sinful color ones. So that was really nice of her. I really appreciate that, Liz. <laughs> this one is insane. It's a Milani. I don't know if you can see it. Oh, okay, but it's Milani. And it's called Garnet Gems. But, oh, I forget what the company was, but, um, they have one, it looks just like this, and that's why she got, she saw it, and she went, oh my gosh, it looks just like it, so that's why she got it, and I thought it was really nice, so I'm really excited for that, because, um, I'm not a fan of red nail polish, like, cream nail polishes, like a red like that or something, you know, just a cream, this I might really like, like, over black, I think that'd be so cool, so I'm very excited for that, and then... <laughs> I guess I complain a lot on Twitter about like my hands being really dry and stuff like that or not being able to get Eucern because Eucern has a really good level of um, you, like SPF in it and it doesn't irritate your skin because I'm, I'm really acne prone and my skin does not enjoy stuff. Um, so she got me that which it was super sweet and I tweeted her I was like do I complain about having dry hands a lot? She goes I don't know. I'm like well I can't get Eucern so that's really cool. And then she got me this, which I'm very excited about, the Sony Kashuk Pointed Foundation Brush. So I'm really excited about that. And it looks really small, like that's my thumb. But I'm thinking it will be good for, um, like to, I don't know, I'm just going to try it. I'm really excited for it because I've never seen one and we don't have them. So I'm really excited about that. And then... She got me two eyeliners and a lip liner. So the lip liner is Jordana and it's Rock and Rose. So yeah, that's what it looks like. And we're going to open it and swatch it. Because I haven't opened it yet. So I was really excited <laughs> when I arrived because she told me, she's like, oh, normally it takes me so long to send it up to Canada and stuff like that. So... I didn't think I'd get it exactly like a week after she sent it. So she sent it last Thursday, which is really exciting. So that's what it looks like. Actually, let's be smart. Yeah, so just a really good nude. And so we're going to leave that on there a little bit and see if it transfers or if it smudges. And then she got me from Bond Bell. And I haven't seen Bond Bell in a really long time up here so that's really neat and it's just their basic eyeliner I believe yeah so just their basic one and it's called basic black which is really funny because I called it their basic one and yeah I like that she got me retractable ones so I think that's really neat um, oh it's really dark too so you can see that so that's kind of awesome I haven't tried that on. What I have on is the amazing... Okay, I have to go find it. Hold on. Hi. Okay. So, she got me one of the famous Milani eyeliners. The, sorry, the Liquify or Liqui Eye. You all know what they are. You're from the States. Anyways, this excited me so much because I've heard a lot about them, right? And so I have it on... I put it on maybe, I'm going to say five hours ago, and I have Makeup Forever Aqua like liner, doesn't stay on my waterline. I found um, Revlon Color Stay, stayed on my waterline better than, make, than the $20 Makeup Forever eyeliner. That's how much it is here. So anyways, so this is a color. And it's really nice because I really like brown on me because it just, I have I've it on right now and it looks black basically. So that's it up here, the top one. And it's called metallic, but I don't see metallic in it at all actually. And it's crazy because it says on the back, it says, okay, so apply the product and allow it dry for 15 seconds and it's set for day and night. And I was like, okay. No, no, I was doing it and it's, it's like butter. Like if you touch it, you can 
completely destroy it. And I touched it right here and I couldn't get off. Like I had to like scrub it off with like um, a makeup removing cloth. <laughs> and then I had to touch up. So I still have it on. I don't know if you can see. Anyways, it's still on my waterline. And I just went and had lunch and I went shopping and I walked around downtown. And then I went and played with a dog. And it's still there and that's crazy and um, my eyes are really watery and stuff and I always get you know sleep in them and stuff and normally it's colored from eyeliner and it wasn't and I'm sorry that that's really disgusting to people but it wasn't not something really special so this is amazing and I may ask you to get me more of this because it's amazing I like if if in Canada if you can order it online or if you are going to the States get it because it's amazing <laughs> so and then she got me a lipstick it's a milani lipstick and when i saw it i was like oh it's a l'oreal lipstick because it looks like l'oreal lipsticks and i was like hey that's cool because i know that like in the states they get stuff before we do like all the sally hansen like the extreme wear nail polishes for fall you guys already have them and we don't and it's really driving me nuts anyway so this one's called Mandarina, it's 42 by Milani. And when I saw the bottle, I was like, oh my gosh. It's insane. That's just, I'm just putting a little bit on it. But can you see what it looks like? Like it's, I think it's really cool. So anyways, I really like that. And it's kind of crazy. And then this is what I'm really excited about because in Canada, for whitening our teeth, all we can get are white strips. And they're really expensive. And if you wanted like a gel that you put in like a tray, you have to go to the dentist. And it's a lot of money because they make you like fit your tra like a tray to your mouth and all that. Like my mom did it, it was a lot of money. So she got me this. And I'm really excited because my teeth are different than normal people. They're really tight together. And so even if I floss and brush my teeth like twice or three times a day, I still have stains on them like I did when I was a kid and stuff like that. I just have really tight, tight together teeth that it was a net, like the dentist told my parents when I was a kid, it's inevitable she's going to have cavities. It's, you can't stop it. It's going to happen. Her teeth are just like that. So this is, this is this. And um, Sony Cash brush basically are the things that like I begged for. I was like, I don't, just send me that. <laughs> I don't care. And then when we talked about like nail polish, I wanted the debush dupe, of course, because I think what I think these are really inexpensive, maybe under five dollars in the states. Like that's awesome to me. But anyways, so she sent me this, and I did it, and it's really, I'm really happy with it. Like I see a difference, so I really hope it makes a difference. So thank you, Liz. And she also sent me a really nice card. Um, I'm going to read it because it's um, it's not personal, so I don't feel weird reading that. And it says, Cynthia, I hope you like everything I picked out for you. And I hope you really, really love green nail polish. I'm so glad I met you, Liz. And I thought that was really cute. So it's just a nice little card. And I thought about writing a note, but I decided not to because I've never done a video before. So I thought this was my card, is that I really hope you enjoy the stuff that I got you. And... Um, yeah, I hope we get to do this again, and I'm happy to meet you as well. Okay, well, that's it.